friends welcome back to another episode of rm cookbook today i'm going to share with you a very delicious recipe of roasted chicken with stuffed rice and resins and nuts now um this is a very easy recipe roast chicken is quite easy anyway but we're just just the only difference is here we are going to stuffing the chicken with rice and this is a very good way of using any kind of leftover rice from previous night or so so let me just show you what are the ingredients you would need in order to prepare this very easy recipe so first of all here i'm going to use some rice which is left over from last night now um fresh rice tends to be quite soft and fluffy but uh, leftover rice is quite stiff and um, you know dry that's a very good rice to use for this recipe and a plate full of uh, mixed nuts and resins I just added it just like that the best way to do it is actually take this mix nut mixed nuts and resins and fry it into your frying pan with some you know extra virgin olive oil if you don't like the flavor of olive oil you can actually use butter fried nuts and resins are quite better than dried the way I actually used and I added a spoon teaspoon of uh, garam masala garam masala is nothing more than mixed herbs if you don't have to use garam masala if you don't like the flavor of it you can use some other herbs and spices of your choice um, but try to use uh, fried nuts and resins rather than the way I have used just straightforward nuts and resins so to that mixture you know I here I have the chicken which has been marinated previously now if you wanted to see the spices I used to marinate the chicken click on the link on the video as it appears and that should show you in another video where I just did straight for a chicken roast and the marination spices are exactly the same so there uh, I didn't actually repeat the spices again so you can see it how I actually marinated it over there but all I'm doing over here is filling the cavity of the chicken with rice and resins once it completely filled up I have to tie the legs together this way as is shown on the video um, so that as it's getting roasted the rice and stuff doesn't come out and uh, the moisture from the rice doesn't um, evaporate uh, through the roasting process otherwise the rice is going to be very dry so um, the best thing is tie the legs up uh, of the chicken I'm just using tin foil wrapped around the legs and this way I just keep the chicken's leg tied together and get the oven temperature to 250 degrees Celsius or 200 degrees Celsius and uh, we're just going to keep this bird inside the oven for around um, one hour 45 minutes or two hours two hours is best because this way the whole meat gets thoroughly cooked completely all the way inside you don't want any kind of pink bit of flesh left inside because if it's pink inside you know that the flesh is not cooked and uh, you need poultry to be properly cooked otherwise you know uh, people might get uh, stomach problems so make sure the chicken is thoroughly cooked that's the reason two hours is good for this kind of bird this is a medium sized bird inside an oven for 250 degrees celsius to 200 degrees celsius and um, that should be it and uh, once that is done take it out of um, the oven as you see I'm just taking out in this section uh, the chicken is fully cooked after two hours I'll just quickly show you from the side how it looks the, because the chicken is freshly out it's bubbling away the oil which actually got out it's not added oil the oil is from the chicken itself it released its own oil the flesh and it's fully thoroughly roasted inside out with the rice still moist no dry rice and everything so now all we have to do is present it in a bowl of salad this chicken can be enjoyed with extra rice or the rice which is inside it anyway that could be quite flavorful because uh, the, as it roasts the chicken re releases all this um, uh, moisture and the flavor from the marination it goes seeps into the rice really delicious really really flavorful and i just over here just presented it with a bit of uh, salad to go with it you can even use bread and other stuff to go with it another good thing to enjoy with this chicken is a homemade ketchup which i did the recipe on some other video so um fried chicken or roasted chicken in this case with homemade ketchup is really delicious so i'll just show you how it is um as you as you just pull on the leg as you can see it's very soft look at the meat it's completely white so you know this way that the chicken is completely cooked 
and the rice itself is also very moist and um, flavorful as you can see the nuts and resins been completely soaked in with all the uh, juices and the flavor which actually seeped out from the chicken the flesh is very soft and tender it's just you know peels off from the bone it's really delicious hope you actually give it a try and um, that's basically it this is how you make roasted chicken with uh, stuffing of rice nuts and resin hope you like this recipe if you did give us like and thanks for your time watching this video